Hi, Realist. Welcome in. Can we get some yos? Dude, I have a type on my go live tweet. You wrote it so well. Thank you. We do calligraphy at the end of every single stream. I I'm really glad you went back and watched it, though. That's so cute. <laughs> I remember. I can't remember who it was, but it was like another first time viewer. And they redeemed the channel points and they said they like screenshotted it. <laughs> Thank you. Dude. So, I wish I could edit tweets. They should just make it a normal function. Editing tweets would be so cool. That's that's legit the only reason why I would consider getting um, Twitter blue. Or I don't even know what it's called because X, ew. But I think editing should be a function on every single social media platform. You just have to indicate that the post is edited, you know? I can see how it could be used negatively. Not if they put a disclaimer that it was previously edited. Because what I do like about um, Twitter, when you edit a post, it'll say like, oh, you're viewing a previous version of this post, or it'll have like a little subtext that says edited. Which is, I think they also do that on Instagram. So that is one way to like tackle misinformation, but I can definitely see how it could be used for like gaslighting. <laughs> Uj, gaslight, geek, keep, girl boss. Everyone on Twitter is a gaslighter, dude. I only the only legit reason why I can't do it. I I'm reposting my go live tweet to because I usually post it to like TikTok and IG and I keep seeing the fucking typo. Ah. Just let me edit, please. Anyway, what was I saying? Oh, everyone online will gaslight you. That's why like I don't debate people in replies. If somebody's saying something I don't like. Or something that's like offhanded or rude. I just delete it. I don't even deal with it anymore. Because in online spaces, people don't want to like genuinely listen. Or listen in a way that it will change their perspective. So like if somebody's giving you shit online. Or if it's something you don't like, just block them. Same goes for like in Twitch chat too. Like if somebody says something, let's just just delete it. I don't condone anything. Unless, unless you're my top gifter, then you know we can figure that out. <laughs> just kidding, dude. I'm like so scared. If anybody like changes, I don't know. Guys, new tweet. Go like it. Okay, face cam. Wait, actually, VTuber model in 10, 10 seconds. People only want to be right and just do it for the attention. You got it. On the nose. Okay, five, four, three, two, one. Guys. PNG Tuber's back. It's been like two months since we've seen her. Um, oopsie. I didn't. November was a busy month for me at jury duty, and then by the time I had time to do calligraphy, it was already like November 20th, so I was like, screw it, we'll save it for like December. So today we're going to be updating the follower journal for everybody who followed during the month of November and October, and we're also doing um, Kobobo's portrait card that they redeemed in, or they gifted five subs in October. Yep, our cam is up everybody, look at her, ain't she pretty? Oh my god, VTuber? Yeah, um, exclamation point model in chat if you want more info. 
Um, I only have one nice DSLR, so whenever we do art streams, we pull out the VTuber, because ain't no way I'm using my... my crappy... USB cam for a face cam. I mean, we do it sometimes, but it's like... it's not worth the trouble. So guys, if you want me to get a second full DSLR camera POV when we do art streams, um... How many gifted subs would that be? Because it's like $800. Because the model I'm looking at is the Sony VZ1 or 2. It's it's a fully functioning USB operated DSLR, which is very hard to come across because most DSLRs you need like a, a memory card or like a capture card in order to stream live. But the Sony V, um, you could just plug and play, use it for streaming, it's made for streamers. Also, I'm real. Face reveal. <laughs> um. And then, because they have like the base model, v, Sony VZ model, but it's like $400, but it doesn't have removable lenses. So it's just crappy. The lens it comes with is shit. So if you want to get like the kit that has a nicer lens, like the 18 to 150 or 135 you have to pay an extra $300 for it. I was gonna get it for a Black Friday because it was 100 bucks off, but it was not in the budget and my sister didn't want to go halfsies on it. Once she gets a job, she said she will get a camera because she wants to like learn basic photography and film. Because she goes on trips a lot, so she wants to like film stuff properly. Okay, guys. You know the drill. Oh, here's a close-up of Kobobo's card. Kobobo sent me a picture of them in a wig. <laughs> I hope Kobobo's in chat later, so we'll do this after follower calligraphy. I also, I need to redo my nails. They're getting long again. I don't, I kind of like this length. But I think I'm going to do green and red for Christmas. It is December. Okay, enough stalling. Everybody start your timers. We're doing... How many followers do I have? I'm so close to 800 followers. I think in this past year I've gained like 200, which isn't a lot. But you know what? I have a lot of chatters and we love chat. By we, I mean not me. <laughs> um, you know, my channel doesn't grow too quickly, but I feel like the chat culture is more cohesive. Okay. Let's get started. Should we do a prediction? I don't know if I want to. I'm debating. Hi, Moon! Welcome in! Can we get some yo's? Hello! Also, I'm like, I'm itching to play Super Mario RPG. I probably won't have time today. I'm so annoyed because my sister, she was supposed to give me grocery money because she she's out for the day. She has to do errands. She was supposed to give me grocery money before she left the house. But she didn't, because I do the shopping, so she'll give me cash, because, you know, I, I'm brokey, so she'll give me cash for groceries. So she didn't give me fucking money, <laughs> so it turned my whole daily schedule around. That's why I'm streaming early. It's about 10 a.m., so about an hour-ish earlier than normal. Because now, instead of going grocery shopping in the morning when everything's on sale, I have to go in the evening when all the boomers are heading home from work and they're all pissy. Big L. Anyway, I'm back to work. Yeah, I have to make sure everything's in frame. Okay. Because I messed with my tripod. That's why, like, it's at a slight angle. It's not, like, a full bird's eye POV today. Also, if you want to know the music that's playing on stream, exclamation music in chat. I'll, it's my playlist that I have on YouTube. I also ordered some more brush pens in the mail because closer to Christmas, I'm probably going to go live on my alt channel, peace and underscore art on Twitch. Um, I have bought a Christmas coloring book. So I ordered some new markers because these ones are mostly dead.
God, this purple is so busted. I love the brush tips on markers. Dude, if you have the chance, put on Santa's... Put on your list for Santa this year. Tombow Dual Brush Tips. These are the sw I'm using, um, oh, exclamation pens in chat if you want, like, actual links to what I'm using. Hashtag not an ad. The ones I'm using for calligraphy are Cali Art. They're cheapy. It's got a brush and a fine point tip. Like, they're pretty decent, decent for the price point, but if you have the chance, beg Santa for some Tombows. The brush tips on the Tombows are so nice. Oh my god, my name is already there. Oh my god, it is! Hi, Orbit. Welcome in. Can we get some yo's? I think you- when did you actually follow the channel? Let's see. Because this is from, I think, September follows. Yeah, so follow September 19th. Yep. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> oh, on moons, it's pens with an S. It's plural. <laughs> Period. Why'd you- Why'd you waste a thousand points for that? You got- Dude. You realize I'm small enough to where, like, I'll see your actual chat message. <laughs> so silly. Okay, we got two names done. Did it just for fun? Okay. <laughs> I don't want you to think you're wasting your points. And I am using a bullet journal. If you want to learn basic calligraphy, it's all about consistency in your line shape and the actual, like, height of your lettering. Oh, what journal am I using? I don't have a link for the journal. Hashtag not an ad, but this is um, rhodia.book. So if you want to learn calligraphy, um, you don't need anything fancy, just get some simple brush pens. That way you get used to, like, how it feels in your hands. I do also have, like, traditional ink tip and quills. But I don't use them often because, like, the, the ink is permanent and I hate the idea of, like, spilling everywhere. I always find numbers to be the most difficult. Probably because I write them the least amount. If you want to see if your name is on a previous page, if you followed in a prior month, um, exclamation FJ for follower journal and chat. And there's a link to a Twitter thread. Because no matter how big I get, I will write your name. Just please? I- I- <laughs> That's also why it's kind of good I don't grow too fast, because imagine having to write down like a thousand names in a sitting. That would be insane. I know we have a lot of new viewers, and it's been a while since we've done this stream. I skipped a month, oops. But the lore is... I did this stream as a joke on April Fools in 2022. So a little over a year ago. And um I had to write 
I think 400 names, because at the time I'd been streaming for about 7 months, I had 400 followers. So I wrote down 400 names in one sitting. It took 6 hours. And I did it as a joke because it was April Fool's, but then at the end of stream I was like, you know, I'm very small, but 400? That's still a lot of people. Because like, anytime I get follow about it, I delete them. I don't like fake followers. I don't do follow for follow because that's technically TOS. I would never do it anyway because when you have a follower account that's too inflated in your engagement, like live viewer account, your chat engagement, or like on Instagram if your likes aren't high compared to your follow account, then it just looks really fake. So, I was like, you know what? Every month I'll do a calligraphy. Because especially when you're small and growing, every person <laughs> literally counts for your long-term success. Dude, I love doing capital GH in this style. I think it's also good to recognize followers in this way because I usually I have follow alerts turned off on my stream because those are one of the easiest forms of like getting hate rated like someone can just buy bot accounts and like have them have like slurs as their username and then have it on screen and then get you in trouble so that's why I don't have follow alerts turned on But doing this type of stream gives them, you know, that crumb of attention. <laughs> oh, so since I wasn't able to go grocery shopping this morning, I didn't get to have breakfast food. You guys want to hear how, like, genuinely dumb I am? The other day, I was making myself ramen. And whenever I make, like, instant ramen... I will, like, fry an egg. So I put my pan on the burner. I also put the carton of eggs on the stove top as well. We have an electric stove. And for some reason, I decided to put the pan on the opposite burner than I usually do. So I turn the burner on. And then, like, after five minutes, I'm like, why isn't the oil heating up? Because I put the pan on the back burner and then the egg carton on, on top of where the front burner is. So... I look at the pan, I'm like, why isn't the oil heating up? And I was like, why does it stink in the kitchen? I lift up the egg carton, it literally melted. <laughs> so, like, it was a whole 18 carton of eggs. And, like, I melted the plastic on the bottom of, like, 12 of them. And, like, the eggs, they were obviously raw, but, like, the shell was, like, a weird shape. So I was like, shit, I have to throw these all away now. <laughs> So, TLDR, I didn't get to have eggs for breakfast today. Yeah, this purple is so busted. Also, chatters, gentle reminder, if you haven't already, click, I don't know if you can see my finger, click the pin chat, fill out the naughty or nice quiz for this year. It will be used for a future stream segment. It takes you like 10 minutes. I know today's stream is a bit more chill, so um, have the stream on in the background and do the quiz right now. You've already had six submissions. Can we get five more today? And if you don't have time to do it now, it is... Pinned on my Twitter, the link. It's a Google Form link.
Honestly, this name is a mood. Such a good username. Okay, that's one page officially done. We are about 16 minutes into this run. Guys, get your timers out. Ooh, that double T, holy. live a little bit early today than normal like I, I would typically will stay at the 11 o'clock time frame like for sure once my sister starts working I'll be back to normal I think it's funny when people have like more than two numbers at the end of their user. You can see two people here. It's like, why, why do you need that many numbers? Are you trying to like have people add you on Discord? They removed the numbers like three months ago. You know what also is very sus? People having their Snapchat and their bios. Ew. Do I have a Discord server? Um, no. Discord server will be enabled when I hit a thousand subscribers. Let me explain. I don't think it's a good idea to have a Discord server when you're a small streamer or creator because being able to like message people directly is fine and all, but you don't want your audience to have direct access to you because especially when you're small, your like core audience, like your, your biggest fans will like want that direct attention. And whenever they don't get it, it will lead to more toxicity over time. And what I've noticed 
is that since I don't have a Discord server, people are more excited to like actually be in the live stream or like chat live. Because if if you are a viewer and you watch the streams and you're able to like message in a server that I'm in or like other viewers are in, then it makes it feel not as special unless the Discord server is large enough to where like a lot of people are engaging in it or um yeah or like a large enough people are engaging in it because like a lot of small streamer ser st smaller streamer discord servers are just dead like nobody chats in them because you don't have a large enough fan base to have a community yet My biggest reason why is, like, I don't want people to message me. I don't want to be pinged throughout the day. Because, like, I have a lot of anxiety related to, like, texting. And one of my friends, she, small streamer, she used to have a Discord server for her fans. Smaller than me, okay? And she had a server. And, like, somebody sell sent, like, pictures of self-harm in, like, the public server on in the discord at like 1 a.m thankfully only like two people saw it i didn't see it because i would have like freaked out um because granted she didn't have like enough moderation tools in place because she didn't know how like discord worked fully but i don't ever want to have an environment to where a viewer or myself can have can be triggered in that way and like obviously that's why i chose to stay with twitch in terms of streaming because they have like the best moderation tools. They have a lot of third party integration. Um, YouTube doesn't have the moderation tools. Kick is like, oh, fuck you if you're like this, this, or this type of person. Um, so yeah, I don't want, I either want to get to a point where like I can pay some people to like moderate throughout the day. Like just have people on standby to like verify every single message before like the general people see it or like I have a large enough community to where I could like I can have a bunch of moderators to where they'll be active more so throughout the day and like honestly if I had a Discord server, I would just be sad posting all day, and I don't want to do that. Like, you guys aren't my friends. Anyway, TLDR, Discord will happen at a thousand subs. People are wild on Discord, truly? Dude. Dude. <laughs> I have joined... A handful of smaller streamer discords and like the vibe ain't it because okay okay how do i say this nicely i don't market myself as like a as someone who's to be desired like i don't make myself like i don't want to be seen like your online gf you know i'm your i'm your friend <laughs> but a lot of people who join, like, a lot of, like, woman streamer servers are there because they're, like, legitimately simps. And, like, even if they aren't, like, vocal about it, you can tell, like, how they interact that it's very, like, subtle. You know what I mean? I don't tolerate any of that shit. No simps in chat. Only friends. <laughs> And, like, I think it's totally fine if you lean into that shtick or gimmick. It's just for, like, 
my personal safety, I don't think that's the best. Okay, this person's name didn't fit. They just had an extra eight. Two pages done. I don't know how many I have left. Oh, I have like, I think 15 or 10 left. I'm getting there. Because I think we got about 30 followers in the past two months. <laughs> Mingus Among Us. It sounds like the next Dr. Seuss book. Oh, we got Moon. Moon was in chat earlier. Oh, I messed up that M. Damn it. Okay. Thank you for hanging out for a little bit today, Royalist. We'll see you next time. But thank you for watching. <clears throat> Dude, that M looks so bad. See, that's why, like, when you do calligraphy, for, in particular, brush, you have to press and then lift. You can't You can't keep dragging your brush tip against the paper. Because then it messes up your stroke shape. Okay, this was Jelani Pokemon Master. I assume they're a Pokemon fan. Also, if you want to be a fan of the channel, follow. Because guys, we are... 30 minutes in the stream, so if you're new here, click follow. You get cool emotes, and you guys to type in chat. And for today only, I'll write your name if you follow today. Ain't no way. And if you're already following, make sure your notifications turned on. That way you don't miss a single stream. Smile. Yeah, I think this comp is over. Let's, let's do something a bit more upbeat. Dude, I want to do Omori. What? Oh. Sorry, it was loud. There we go.
Dude, threes are my favorite, hands down. Threes or fives? I like anything with a flat top on the number. I think it's because I really like geometric S shapes. And you don't see a lot of curvature in geometry. Or an artificial, like geometry. Because as you go about your day, you notice there aren't a lot of straight lines in nature. I think I forgot to say it earlier, but Wolves got best clipper of November once again. I think that's like your fourth or fifth month in a row. Let's go. So Wolves had the most clips in the best of compilation that was posted on Monday. So he will get a gift card. Okay, we're getting to followers from yesterday. The final four. Yeah, the tails didn't touch. We're gonna pretend we didn't see that. Another page done. Oh, the final two. Final two, everybody. Get ready to spam. You were here. God, I almost put it out. Holy shit. Saved. Oh my god. Okay, final name of the day. Hopefully I don't mess up. Okay, this person has three T's here. Unheard of.
Here we go. Stop the timer. 42 minutes. That took about... 34 minutes. Not bad. Okay. So. That was all the followers my channel had in the past two months. So all the followers from... October and November and December so far. Let's review. Can you feel free to screenshot? I will post these on Twitter later. There we go. Thank you to everybody who followed during the month of, or months of November and December. Thank you. Okay, now we're gonna move on to sketch cards. So today we're doing Kobobo. They gifted five subs during October. So anybody who gifts a total of five subs by the end of any calendar month will get a custom portrait card, custom portrait sketch card drawn and mailed to them after it's made. Right now we have Keelan with six gifted for the month, so Keelan will be eligible for a sketch card at the end of this month. So, oops, haha, <laughs> <laughs> no free feet. <laughs> God damn it! Dude, thank you to thank goodness I'm a Pigs under the desk. Okay. So Kobobo sent me a picture of a wig this month. It was a Wendy's ass looking wig. So and they're wearing a yellow sweater. So I think maybe I can do a theme of primary colors. So you know, red, yellow, blue. Go back to kindergarten. So I think I'll do that. I was thinking of doing because the wig was red, shirt sweater was yellow, it was like a golden rod. And maybe the background blue. Okay, let's get started with inking. I'm gonna use my socket of micron and then I might go back and do brush tips. I'm, I think I'm gonna start with the number three. Also, for the picture, <laughs> go bubble pokered their limbs. <laughs> we'll have to ask Kobobo what they actually dressed up as for Halloween. But they made their eyes look crazy. Kobobo has, has really big eyes, but they made them huge for this picture. Gonna add some eyelashes. You know when you have like a, okay i shouldn't say normal but like the typical eye you don't see the full iris right kobo have their eyes wide enough to where you can see like the full white around their iris i'm gonna use a number one to line the irises
Okay, and they have their classic clear glasses. So I'm going to use that with a silver gel pen that I'll do at the very end. Okay, in the picture, Kobobo's chin was super exaggerated. Like, they literally sucked in their cheeks to have the, the lines here. They kind of look like Skeleton Bride. I think I'm gonna do the hair with a thicker outline. I'm gonna go in it with a number eight on something crazy thick. I want the hair to look kind of cartoony. That's why I did that, that. <laughs> Murby-esque twirl. Or swirl.
Yeah, this side looks kind of weird. Okay, so now that I've filled in the larger shapes with the A point, I'm going to go in with a 1, or number 3. Because I want the be, I want the hair to be mostly line art. Because since Kolbobo is wearing a woven sweater in the picture, it's going to be a lot of grays with the line art. Filling in makes a load of difference. Because depending on how close I do the thinner lines, I can define how light or dark different sections of the hair will be when it's colored. There you go. That looks crazy. Crazy good. That came out better than I thought it would. For some reason, I was thinking of doing like daisies for this car, but I don't know how well that fits. Like cerulean blue background, black border, white flowers in the background, just daisies, yellow centers. That could be cute. Okay, I'm gonna do the details for the sweater now.
I'm looking at the picture. Okay, so it was just lines going down basically. So I'm not going to do solid, I'm going to do very light and kind of scraggly. So just applying the least amount of pressure. There we go. Just a little bit of texture, that way it's still not just a solid yellow. You know what else is pretty solid? Subscribing, because guys, we are an hour into stream, so it's time for me to run some ads. You can avoid that ad by subscribing, or $4.99, just $5. Skip your coffee and get ad free viewing all month long, or you can link your Amazon Prime to your Twitch and hashtag sub for free with Prime. Click subscribe! See if you have a Prime sub available. Okay, line work on this card is just about done. I gotta do the eyebrows. I always forget. Okay, let's get- ooh! I accidentally clicked the mouse, everything is fine. Dude, the cheek lines look scary. Okay, I think I'm going to use more muted colors because I don't want to use too bright a red or too bright a yellow. So I'm going to go with like a very light yellow. I'll start off with a, a lighter red and then go over with a darker. And then for the background... I'll do a medium blue. And then the centers of the day face. Yeah, 
Let's get to coloring. Yeah, I forgot to do the line art within the collar. Now for the hair. So I'm going to color it all in with this lighter red and then go over some of the more intended darker spaces with the maroony red. Okay, the red looks super bright. Um, should be fine. Kovovo has like golden blonde hair or dirty blonde. There we go. Okay, now I'm gonna go and fill in some of the sections with the darker maroon. It's a very subtle difference because the black line art fills in a lot. We see the difference between the left and the right side. I think the hair came out perfect. I'm gonna add some outer lines after I fill in the background blue.
I think I want to fill the background in with color pencil, that way I just get like a solid blue. So I'm gonna do the border. No, I should do border last. Daisies first. Sorry, just the theme shift. <laughs> yeah, we can play a little bit of Mario Kart. I'm like itching to play actual Mario Kart though. Daisy Zone. Okay, now I'm gonna add some outer hairlines with red. Just to make it look a bit more messy. Now I'm going to fill in the background. I'm going to clean up my space a little bit before I get some of my color pencils out.
I'm gonna be using classic Prismacolor. I love the smell of them. I'm gonna need to sharpen it. Now a strap when you're coloring color or sharpening color pencils. You move the utensil, not the actual pencil. Because when you move the pencil, it'll be a bit too hard on the actual lead. Hi, Keelan. Welcome in. Can we get some yo's? Hello. I started stream early today because I gotta do errands at like noon, so. But hello. Yeah, I'm here on time. You guys are just early. Yeah, I wanted to get a little bit overtime in today, you know, make the boss happy. Keelan, are you gonna get a sketch card for this month? Just curious. Because I think you've only gotten one sketch card ever. I really got eczema on my face. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that, hon. One of my friends in high school, she had eczema all over her legs, arms, and face. And it took her like years to find an ointment that worked. I don't know what it is, so I don't know the tips, but I'm sorry. Like, I have pretty bad acne. Like, it was really bad when I was a teenager and like just out of high school. But once I started birth control, my acne got a little bit better. I still have a few, like, acne scars. But it's just because I pick at them. Which is, I know my fault, but... I hope you can find something that works for you, man. I'm really excited to play more art Mario more Mario RPG tomorrow. You do have a cream that helps but it still pops up from time to time. They should just wait, didn't Anthem Adam Levine? have an eczema cream on? Like, wasn't he a spokesperson for one? If so, I would get his. Ooh. 
The thing that I don't like about working with colored pencils is that it's very easy to track the pigment and wax around your your working space. Like I have some on my ring finger here. Or my middle finger. <laughs> you gotta be careful. That's why working big is really scary in my opinion. Because it's very easy to like track your whole wrist against your working plane. Wait, this music is... it's the ice cream world. Sweet Sweet Cavern. Dude, I'm like practicing for the Can You Guess the Mario Kart song. I'm gonna do that in probably like two weeks. So I've been listening to Mario Kart music trying to guess. Christmassy though with the bells. Almost done. Debating. I think it looks fine without a border. I just gotta do the glasses now. Oh my god, I almost knocked out my whole color and pencils. Oh my god, I would have screamed. Santa, I want new color pencils. I'll do a very light pink. Mm-hmm. Yes, sir. Sorry, I was just seeing if the PNG tube worked. <laughs> I also think I want to add some, like, shadow lines under the neck. Guys, if you haven't already, take the naughty or nice quiz. It is pinned at the top of chat. That doesn't add much, but I like it. I also gotta do the eye shine.
I'm gonna go over it one more layer with silver. Just to make it a bit darker. Or a bit more opaque, as an artist would say. There we go, I think it's done. I really like how the hair came out. Simple, but lovely. I really like the red lines on the outside of the, the hair. <laughs> the face. <laughs> Dude. There we go. There's Kobobo's card for October. If you yourself want your own custom board sc sketch card, all you must do is give five subs by the end of the month and you'll have your card drawn in January. Let's go. Okay, guys, let's wrap up what we did today. Okay, don't show feet this time, Peason. We did sketch cards for October. This will be mailed out to Kobobo later this week. And then all the followers from October, November. I also did a time racer earlier today, and my average went down from 52 to 50. I was not typing like a madman today. Yeah, I still find it funny that Ryan had an alt <laughs> that he didn't even know about. There we go. So I think that will wrap up stream for today. If anybody wants to do calligraphy, use your channel points or donate to the channel right now. I'll give you one minute. Any redeemers? Oh my god, it's 11-11. Make a wish, make a wish. Okay, you guys had a minute. I will wrap it up here for today. Thank you everybody for watching. Any chatters and lurkers? Kobobo's sketch card will be mailed out to them tomorrow. Along with some Pokemon cards from the <laughs> Halloween booster pack stream. I'll sign the bags. Anyway, plan is simple. Make sure you guys do the naughty or nice quiz. I'll link it in the chat for the VOD watchers. It is also pinned at the top of chat. Have you been naughty? Oh shit. I was knocking my mouse down. Have you been naughty or nice this year? Do the quiz today and find out. It will be used for a future stream segment. And if you aren't already, make sure you are subscribed to my YouTube channel's main channel for weekly stream highlights and then clips channel for daily stream. And then the clips channel for daily stream clips. Go subscribe. It's free to subscribe over there. I'll be live again tomorrow with more Super Mario RPG. I'm really excited. I really like the game. And then Friday, ranking every single Mario Kart track. Not including the DLC, because the DLC is too long. That'll be a separate stream. Anyway, thank you all for watching. I will see you guys tomorrow. Goodbye.
I just realized I still have Valentine's Day chocolate. Bruh. Okay, bye guys. I'll see you later.